Another twist now tonight in a notorious Salem murder case. The state intends to fight a federal court ruling that would let the man convicted of killing former Oregon prison director Michael Franke 30 years ago go free. Tonight, our Lisa Balick is following the story and talked one on one today with one of Franke's brothers. Yeah, Kevin Frankie is furious at the state's trying to keep Frank Gable locked up for his brother's death. Frankie, along with a federal judge, believes that Frank Gable is paying for a murder he didn't commit. Do find the defendant. Count one, aggravated murder, guilty. In 1991, Frank Gable was sentenced to life in prison without parole. A jury finding him guilty of aggravated murder in the death of state prison director Michael Frankie. The investigation and trial cost taxpayers millions of dollars. Through the years, many questions about whether Gable was really guilty. Even the brothers of Michael Frankie don't believe that he was the killer. And it just didn't make sense. From the beginning? From the very beginning. It's why Kevin Frankie, Michael's brother, was ecstatic last month when a U.S. federal court judge ruled that Frank Gable is probably innocent and did not get a fair trial. Judge John Acosta ordered Gable be retried or set free. But now, the Oregon Department of Justice is appealing that ruling, trying to keep Gable behind bars. Kevin Frankie is furious. Why can't they swallow their pride and say we screwed up? There isn't a case here. We're keeping a man in prison that's costing us $35,000, $40,000 a year just in incarceration fees alone to save face. Gable was convicted of stabbing the prison director to death in 1989 outside the corrections headquarters in Salem. But there was no knife recovered, and another man, who is now dead, had confessed. But that confession was not allowed in Gable's trial. The federal judge criticized the investigation, including witness polygraphs, and in his almost 100-page ruling, also pointed to the evidence that another man had confessed. My sense is they don't have a case. Ultimately, Frank Gable will walk. Walk out of prison. Now, he's being held at a Kansas prison. A hearing on all this is set for July 9th. We will definitely be there. Yeah, an interesting story, Lisa. Thanks for the update.